Hello gamers and welcome back to another Hopixel Skyblock video. Last episode, I somehow managed to get over half a billion coins, which finally allowed me to get my very own Ender Dragon Pack. Then, after some crazy luck in dungeons, I managed to get back to 86 million coins in only a couple of runs. Coins that I desperately needed for today's grind. Because the next mayor is none other than Triple Perk Aatrox. And if you watched last video, I attempted to play Master Mode Dungeons. I got completely destroyed. Since one of my goals right now is to get into Master Mode Dungeons, and to even have a chance there, you need to get a Terminator. And to unlock a Terminator, I need Enderman Slayer level 7. Thanks to Aatrox's first perk, the quests are only going to cost half the price. His second perk is going to give me 25% more Slayer XP, making this a lot cheaper and a lot faster. I could not have asked for a better mayor, but he's been elected in 15 hours, which is not right now. I'm not combat 60 yet, so I'm gonna take this time to maybe get one more combat level before he's elected. So once again, I'm going to grind Zealot Bruisers. I may have 86 million coins, but that is nowhere near enough to get a Terminator. And there it is, Combat 58. This grind took me around 6 hours to complete, and during that time I got not only one, but two full greater backpacks of summoning eyes, as well as three extra in my inventory. That's an average of slightly more than 12 summoning eyes per hour. Not terrible, but also not very good. I also managed to drop an epic golem pad, and I got a total of 81 crystal fragments. Some of those were from dragons, but the vast majority were from zealots. I also surprisingly made quite a lot of coins from just killing the enderman. I just crafted all the crystal fragments into catalysts, and that is going to be worth 6.5 million coins, and a full inventory of summoning eyes is 16.7 million coins. They dropped a little bit since last video, so this makes sense. I'm just gonna let this stuff sell overnight, it's pretty late already, so I'll check how many coins I made in the morning. Alright, my bizarre offers should have failed, and yes they did, I got 43 million coins to claim. There we go, I'm now sitting at 135 million coins. And as you would expect, Aatrox is currently elected with all three of his perks. But unfortunately, I only have two days and 16 hours left. I could not grind the past two days, so I lost quite a lot of time. Before I start grinding the Enderman, there is actually something I want to do. My equipment pieces are pretty bad, I just have a random implosion belt. I have a gas cloak, I don't know why. The Thunderbolt necklace, I actually crafted this myself and got some pretty decent attributes, but I could do much, much better. As for the gauntlet, I have good attributes, but I could do much better. Also, these things are incredibly cheap to craft, so I'm just gonna make a bunch myself. I just need a bunch of enchanted leather and a lot of enchanted glowstone dust, so let's just get those real quick. How much is it to fill my inventory? Four million coins! Eh. Uh-huh, this is probably a little bit more expensive. Yeah, just just a stack is 700k. Alright, let's make a bunch of um, gauntlets now. Okay, now the reason I switched to Forge is so that I could do this. Lore, mana. Okay, we got four with the mana attribute. Mana regen, that's great, that's what I'm looking for. Another- <gasps> Yo, this one kinda goaded. This one kinda goaded, bro. Mana pool and mana regen? I'm looking for veteran and mana regen for slayers, though. Oh, veteran, there we go, that's what I'm looking for. Um, Another veteran, that means I can make veteran two. Oh, I got another mana pool mana regen, that's really good. Alright, let's see the cheapest one with those exact attributes. It is 1.3 million coins, and this thing costs like 20k to create. Craft. Oh, that's the perfect one. I can just combine them now. That's exactly what I want. Oh, yeah, I can combine it with this one, make three, then make another four, and then combine them to make mana regen five, which is 12.5%. How much are these in the auction house? A million coins. Really? I highly doubt that. I think that's a good flip. Because just plain old mending is a million coins, so there is no way mending plus mana regen is going to be a million coins. <laughs> What? Seven mil? Did I just get flipped? Wait, that was you? <laughs> no, Ari, why did you sell it for so cheap? Well, I guess you at least learned a lesson, right? Uh, but like the other one had mana regen three. So I'll sell these for four million coins, I guess. I don't know. I mean, if they don't sell, I don't really lose anything. I can just set them up later for a cheaper price. Wait, did I reach limit for putting stuff up? Yes, I got two. <gasps> 28 million coins to claim, and I just claimed 10 million coins earlier. Bro, 
Why did I even grind zealots? Time to start spending money though. But before we continue, I have to tell you about today's sponsor, Mindtree. You might remember Ore Hunt from a couple of months ago, but this time they're releasing a brand new game mode, Quarantine. Once the game starts, some of you are infected with a zombie virus. This grants them a couple of abilities to help them spread around the virus, while the rest of you are equipped with a variety of guns and other items to stop the infection from breaking out. And after the game ends, you can use your coins to rent and buy better weapons. You can also join my crew and compete for unique rewards as a team. I know this is a sponsorship, but I genuinely really enjoyed this game mode and I highly recommend you check it out. Oh, and they were kind enough to give everyone who joins their Discord a reward. But anyways, let's get back into the video. Time to start spending money though, because the Glowstone Gauntlet is not the only thing I'm going to get. I'm also gonna get an Implosion Belt with uh, good attributes. I definitely want Mana Regen on an Implosion Belt. And the cheapest one is 3 million coins. Okay, it's not crazy expensive. I don't think Veteran would be good because it doesn't really give that much of a boost. Maybe just Mana Pool? Oh my god! Wow! 28 million coins. I'll just take Mana Regen then and take the L. Let me just claim another 11 million coins. This is just crazy. It still feels like this is contraband somehow. For my other two pieces, which is just a random gas cloak and a Thunderbolt Likeness, I'm going to get the Molten Equipment. So let's just get Molten um, Cloak. Let's go for Mana Region again. 11.6 million coins, but it is Mana Region 3. And look at this thing's stats. 20 Strength, 30 Health, and 20 Defense. Actually, kind of useful. Plus, I kind of want to get into Kudra, so uh, I probably need this at some point. Yeah, let's just get this one. Mana Region 3 for 11.6 million coins. Boom. Uh, necklace. Okay. Mana region again. Mana region one for 12 million coins. All right. Uh huh. <laughs> sure. What about this one? 30 mil for mana region. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think uh, I think we're skipping this one, chat. <laughs> what about mana pool? Mana region is a little bit too spicy. I mean, too pricey on this one. I think I'll go for this one. Life regen isn't great, but at least it's somewhat useful. Plus, this one is already reforged, so uh, thank you. Let's just get three of this. For 3.1 mil. Boom. Boom. And boom. I finally have pretty good um, equipment pieces. Let's just switch everything. Okay, there we go. Why am I not one-shotting them? Am I bad at the game? I mean, I am, but like, why am I not one-shotting them? Oh, I'm using Enderman Pet for extra XP. That makes sense. Okay, so here's the plan. I'm just gonna have Ari the Monkey burst the boss down, and uh, I'll go through the hit phases and tank the damage for him. That is my purpose. I'm gonna be a sponge. And he's dead. Let's go. Oh my god, Twilight Arrow Poison? I think that's actually profit. Um, yeah, with Aatrox it is. Gimme, 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 gimme! Okay, okay, got rid of it. Good. Oh, he's doing the funny. <gasps> oh my god, the funny almost killed me. That's not very funny. Okay, I should kill him now, right? 12, and he's dead. Let's go. Watch it drop core right now. Aw, that's so sad. No core. My souls just died. I only have a single skeleton. Okay, I'll, I'll get real souls after this boss. I'll get like a Necromancer sword with uh, tank souls from M3. Oh, surprise. Uh, let's see. Oh, there we go. Level 80. I think that's M3, right? Now let's just get this one. And then boom, there we go. Oh my, look at that. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> I got a full inventory of ender pieces. All right, so right now I'm doing 1.3 million damage. I'm very curious to see how much that, uh, how much damage I'm going to do with the other power. And he's dead. Okay, let's check. Let me call up uh, Maxwell and learn a brand new power. Boom. It's hurtful. That was hurtful? It was so expensive. Let's switch to strength now. I think this one gives me a little bit too much crit damage. So let, let's check. Is it balanced? No, but it's much better than the previous one I had. Oh, I can actually one-shot them now. So I'm definitely doing more damage with this. What's your MP? Like 800 and something, I think? Actually, speaking of magical power, let me call up Rusty right quick and get myself the brand new accessory. They introduced this with the uh, with the Spider Island quality of life thing. There's actually a couple of new accessories, but this one I can just instantly get right now. So let's do that. And you go. That was a cheeky little three magical power. Let's see how much damage I do now. 1.6 million! That's a 300k increase! I did not expect that much damage. I'm gonna be completely honest. Okay, he's gonna do the funny pretty soon. Yep, there we go. And he is dead. That was much, much faster, even though I did lose a little bit of attack speed. Because this gives 59 bonus attack speed, while this only gives 15. Still, attack speed is attack speed. Oh my god, what the frick just happened? <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'm going to a different island. That was too embarrassing. The server just yeeted me away. It was like, you're not ready for this. Get out of here. 
<gasps> oh god, I nearly missed that thing. <laughs> Bro, it was so expertly hidden. The boss is getting better at the game. The AI will soon take over. We're duped. Look at that, another excellent placement. This boss has like 5 billion IQ. <gasps> Wait, it, uh, huh? He died, and then the boss died. Uh, <laughs> just got a new PC, GG's. I just said good game to someone getting a new computer. I make congrats. But remember, with great specs comes great responsibility. You must not play Fortnite, my child. We hit 60K, that was the goal for today. I'll get 20K tomorrow, and then 20K on Sunday. Now there's been a change to the plan because yesterday, I said I was going to get 20K per day, but I did some off-camera grinding, and now I'm up to 30k XP. So I only need um, 30k XP, which I believe I can easily do in just a couple of hours. I also did some Kuja runs yesterday, and uh, I dropped a couple of things, like the Mandra, which is 12 million coins in the bazaar, a Wheel of Fate, a freaking Mana Regen 3 Molten Cloak, uh, this one isn't very good, but it's still worth a little bit of coins. Um, so yeah, I got some pretty good RNG yesterday. Oh my god, that is spicy. You'll love to see it. Wheel of Fate. Yesterday it was 11 mil. I don't know why it's down bad right now. I think I'll hold on until it goes up to 11 mil and then I'll sell it. Because I don't really need the coins right now. Use Warden Helmet? I tried, but I'm too squishy. I will do more damage with, uh, Warden Helmet. Don't get me wrong, it is better for just straight up damage. But I lose, um... I lose a lot of defense and also attack speed, which is good. Actually, before I move on, I dropped a couple of Smarty Pants books. So I'm just going to combine those two and upgrade my own because I only have level two. So let's just go ahead and do that real quick. Boom. That gives me five more mana. Wow, incredible. <laughs> it's Firevale one for hit phase and it does a lot of damage too. Ooh, I haven't thought about that. I guess I could replace the zombie sword. I don't really use that thing very often. I guess whenever I want to heal now, I got to use hype. That's pretty much what I do anyways. What? How am I at pretty much full mana? I used Hype, I spawned the Bozos, and I used Fire Veil Wand. And I'm still at full mana. Dude, mana reach then is actually just cracked. Ooh, I think Fire Veil is actually pretty useful. I'm going through hit phase a lot faster than usual. I don't even care about the beacon. I'm killing this guy. Okay, got it. Just 10 more bosses, and then we'll be done. It's 6,000 XP till the next level. All right, nine more bosses, eight more bosses, seven bosses. Legendary pet incoming. I mean, it's only epic, but at least I dropped a pet. <laughs> oh, oh, it's dead, but I guess um, six more bosses or five. I can't remember. And five more bosses. It's five. I did the math. This is the worst boss by far. And it's dead. Oh my god. Okay, four more bosses. Roses are red, violets are blue. I use code interests and so should you. Yes! <laughs> Alright, three more bosses. Two more bosses. Just one more boss, right? Yeah! And the very last boss is dead. Just gotta, just gotta call my boy Maddox. And boom. Enderman level 7. So now if I kill a boss, I have a chance of dropping a judgment core. A very small chance, but it's there. Which is important to me because I decided instead of buying a terminator or buying a judgment core and then crafting the bow, I want to drop my very own judgment core. The item is just too cool not to get myself. Worst case scenario, I'm going to have to fill up the RNG meter and I'm already 10% there. But I already dropped our RNG drop in this layer, so I have a feeling I might actually get lucky. Plus, Aatrox is living in 21 hours, so I want to know life this layer while I can. You might notice something a little bit different. I replaced my Soul Whip with the Ragnarok Axe. Let me show you why. So when the Bozo starts this phase, I can start using the Ragnarok Axe. As you can see, it takes three seconds to cast, but once it does, it gives me double its strength, or like 1.5, something like that. But anyhow, I do insane damage with this thing. 1.8 million. One time I did 2 million damage in full final destination. That is crazy for me. Unfortunately, it does take three seconds without taking any damage for the ability to trigger. So I can only use it twice during the boss fight. Also, it takes 500 mana, which is quite a lot. But, you know, mana region go brr. I don't really have mana issues anymore. Which is insane to think about because I don't even have ultimate wise on my katana. And I'm just constantly spamming this thing. And boom, he's dead. I don't have ultimate wise on this guy either, but I did get it on my fire veil wand. Combat 59 and skyblock level 209. I got an entire level just from this slayer. <gasps> wait, 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 wait. Is that, is that? Uh, did you, did you loot share this? He, he loot shared the, he, why? Why admins? Why not me? Why? 
Why, bro? <laughs> Honestly, though, you've been giga chatting. You deserve it. GG's, my guy. Wait, have I lost my souls? I did lose my souls. Oh man. I guess it doesn't really matter. Okay, he did. <gasps> Yo! Core! Wait, two cores? Someone else loot shit? Bro! Dude, my meter was at like 19.4%. I love Enderman Slayer. I love Enderman Slayer. How many how many bosses? How many bosses have I have I killed? Just under 300. 273. And I drop the judgment core. Okay, so we need three null blades, each one being 20 million coins. I'm just gonna buy these from auction house. I'm honestly too lazy to craft every single one myself. This thing's sold, so let's claim that. Gimme, give gimme. Give Boom. Boom. Second one. Third. Let's claim those bad boys. All right. Now I need four tessellated ender pearls. I didn't even know these things existed. 21 million coins. Oh my god. It would be much cheaper to buy them individually, right? Let's just buy them. Okay. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Okay. Seven. Eight. And now I need two stacks of tarantula silk and four braided griffin feathers, which are 17 million coins each. <laughs> what? What? I thought I would save coins by dropping the judgment core. What is this? Okay, I guess I'm selling the diamonds. Uh, where is it? Yes. Don't worry about how I got these diamonds. Definitely did not dupe them. I actually did not dupe them. If any admins are watching, are watching please don't ban me. Oh, let's just NPC sell. You were saying I'm broke, right? <laughs> not anymore. <laughs> Uh, I needed four. One, two, three, counting with interests, and four. And then um, two stacks of tarantula silk. This should be a little bit cheaper right now because Aatrox is mayor. Okay, it's just 9.2 million. There we go. Completely not broke right now. And boom. Terminator acquired. Do I have enough to enchant it? Let's use the hex. Cause it's cool. Enchantments. Wait, let's start with the ultimate enchant. Let's go with Soul Eater 5. Power 6. I'm not going for 7. <laughs> Flame, definitely. Okay. Um, infinite Quiver. Yes, please. <gasps> Yo, Dragon Tracer. I'm going to do so much damage to dragons now. I just realized. Snipe. 3, not 4. Because that's 100 million coins. <laughs> Cubism. Yes. Overload 5. Uh, kind of expensive, but yeah, it's a very good enchant. Piercing. I'm out of XP. Okay, I think we got all the enchants that I was I would normally get. Um, let's get reforges. I'm going with precise. I'm I'm not getting I'm not getting spiritual. Precise all the way. Stay mad. Recom. There we go. It's mythic books. Yes, hot potato books, please. Oh, I don't have to use the anvil anymore. I can just do this, dude. The hex is so cool. I'm kind of completely broke, so I'm not doing fumings at the moment. Yeah, I'll do a book of stats. Why not? Uh, what else? What else am I missing? Stars, right? Yeah, I need dragon essence. Wait, do I have enough? No, I don't. Okay. Whatever, I can just use the hex. There we go. Five starred. There we go. It's now been dungeonized. Only thing I'm missing is um fuming potato books. Which I cannot, well, I can get, but I would be literally dirt poor. Art of War plus five strength for 6.1 million coins. Bro, I'm broke. 19 million coins is everything I have to my name right now. Oh, wait, no, I have 20 mil in the bank. <laughs> I keep forgetting about that. Okay, I guess we're getting Art of War then. Fine. There it is. Master Stars? Bro, I can't! That is actually, I cannot do, even if I want. Oh, okay, I guess I could get one star. Well, I am gonna be using this in Master Mode, so... Yeah, there it is, one Master Star. My first Master Star ever. And of course, it had to be on the Terminator. Add Fumings. Screw it, screw it, I'm just going completely broke, whatever. There you go, there you go. Don't arch. Okay, I, I will go Burrs, I'll go Burrs. Potion, oh, thank you, I forgot. No tank? Oh, GG's. It's over. I want to see my damage. How much damage? 5... 25 mil? That doesn't feel right. That does not feel right. There we go! That's more like it. 67 mil! That was not 67 million damage. That was 6.7 million. But I was far too excited for me to read numbers properly, so... I'll just let it slide. I need- I need more mobs. I need more mobs. Soul Eater? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was doing damage without Soul Eater. Okay, there we go. We got a little bit down here. Oh my god, I can just jump in now without thinking! Okay, maybe not. I just took a lot of damage. I have explosive arrows. I don't have bouncy. I should have gotten bouncy arrows. Oh, dude! I just destroyed a fill! I'm one-shotting. Dude, I'm good. I'm just good at the game now. I do, like, no damage without crit. That is so sad to look at.
Ooh, I could also get glue arrows. I hear these are very OP. Not bouncy armor shred? Really? Okay, I guess we'll go for armor shred arrows then. Bro, can I please crit? <laughs> okay, 62. So somewhat similar damage, but I'm just gonna completely destroy mini bosses and stuff. And Phil is dead, right? Yeah, there we go. Not even a challenge. That thing does not terrify me. Okay, mini boss. Oh god, these things are not to be messed with. I need an ice spray wand for mini bosses. But hey, I'm doing it. It's just gonna take very long. <laughs> and dead. First mini boss, an M5 down. Restart? Oh, well, everyone da died except certain and I because we're just absolute giga chats. Uh, also, let's change to this. Oh my god, that gives a lot of crit chance. Gauntlet of Contagion. Can I can I afford that? Bro, I have 14.8 million coins left. Oh, I have exactly enough. Oh, chat, don't make me do this. Ooh, I seem to be creating a lot more often. What's my crit chance? 97! First choice is definitely the play. I just one shot of fell. Ooh, this feels good. This feels good, man. There's always a sniper over there, and I have a feeling that thing would have probably one shot me. Two fells just gaming over here. Sir, why do you have like 80 million health? No, trap room. I don't want to do trap. I want to test my Terminator. Uh, <laughs> he just got one shot by the skeleton. <laughs> I'm looking for the mini boss because there's usually one here. Around here. I really hope it's not a uh, shadow assassin because that thing is absolutely terrifying. That, okay, it's just a, a lost adventure. I'm gaming. Just stay right there and take and don't use your bow, please. I'm the only one allowed to do ranged damage here. Wait, why, why am I only doing a million damage now? Is it because it has a ton of de defense? Oh, where did you come from? What? What? Oh, I forgot. I forgot the potion. Me forgetting the potion is not the reason I died. I just suck at the game. There is a lot of upgrades I still need to do before taking on master mode. And in case you're wondering, we lost the run, by the way. Once again, thank you, MindTree, for sponsoring the video. The IP is in the description, as well as the pinned comment. I genuinely highly recommend you check out their new game mode. But anyways, thank you so much for watching, gamers. Thank you to my channel members. And I'll see you later. Peace.